Welcome to educational channel. So this video I'll explain you about algebra and its introduction and we'll see some uh, simple and important basics. Okay, generally when you uh, look about this algebra is nothing but the extension of arithmetic. Okay, the algebra is nothing but some extension to arithmetic. So what is this arithmetic or what is this algebra and how it will use in this uh, mathematics we'll see. So algebra is a calculations from unknown to known. Okay, that means the basic use of algebra is to find out the unknown numbers. Okay, example I'll give you first of all. Okay, for example, dash plus 4 is equal to 6. So some number plus 4 is equal to 6. So in this case, we can say this number, right? So that value is 2. Now, instead of giving this number 2, we will take some x, y, some letters we will take. So, the unknown numbers is x. Now, I can write this statement, some x plus 4 is equal to 6. Okay, instead of giving a dash plus 4 is equal to 6, in the place of this, we can keep any letters. So, generally, the uh, unknown numbers, we can treat as letters. And these are the numbers. So, here we have constants and variables okay in this example the x is nothing but 2 because if x value is 2 now this statement is correct okay that's why you can take unknown value to finding the unknown values nothing but the main basic use of this algebra and this is an extension to arithmetic okay then that way it's easy to understand now for example okay constant and variable these two terms you must know first of all so variable in the place we can keep any letters so english alphabets or letters so simple small letters cap letters also we can use so if the question is t plus 3 is equals to 7 then what is the value of this t okay t is the unknown number now so t is nothing but is a variable now this value we need to find out to uh, make this statement is true so, for what value of t, it becomes true. That means t plus 3 is equal to 7. Okay, if t place, if we keep 1, 1 plus 3 is not 7. So, this is not correct. And t is equal to, if it is 4, then 4 plus 3 is 7. So, it's a correct. That means unknown values only we will find out using the main concept of this algebra. So, any values. Not only plus, you can take some into also. For example, 3 into dash is 18. So, in this case, we can find out this place. So, in the place, instead of giving gap, in the form of algebra, we will write 3 into some x. Okay, 3 into x is equals to 18. Then, for what value of x, that statement should be true. So, if x is equal to 6, that means in the place of x, 6 if I will keep, then 3, 6 are 18. So, x value is 6. So, in this way, this is an easy uh, technique to find out the value of unknown things. So, you need not to confuse about. This is a simple basic thing. So, how to solve the equations in the form of different different forms? Okay, I will show you examples. Minus 3 plus x is equal to some 16. Otherwise, x plus 2 is equal to some 3x plus 5. So, like this type of questions different different equations we have so any type of equation how to solve in the form of uh, concept of algebra so we'll see a uh, one by one so it's the only basic thing so next video listeners, i'll show in different different forms how to solve easily and using some simple techniques also when you're converting plus to minus minus to plus or into to division there are also everything i'll explain you from the next videos from topic wise thank you for watching this video to understand the concept of each and everything in Vedic Maths you need to follow in order. So we are providing the numbers for every video. You better follow in order to understand easily and to gain the knowledge more. At the same time, share with your friends and subscribe the channel also because uh, this channel is meant for students to those who improve their knowledge and logical and reasoning skills. And we are providing the links also in description below. You just to follow that uh, links and website link also is given according to your knowledge you can improve that thank you